So what you're looking at here is an interactive experience that we've called the Metasys Automation and Integration uh, Experience, where we have integrated multiple building systems together to highlight the power of Metasys as it coordinates and controls all of these building systems, which includes fire from Simplex, Tyco Security, uh, lighting, POE lighting, shade controls, and of course our HVAC, and a simple fan to represent a terminal HVAC unit. And all of this ties in to our Metasys control system. All right, and over here, what we're uh, gonna show you is an example of the Metasys user interface. And in particular here, we're highlighting a high school. And what's really different about this than what you probably have seen if you've seen a Metasys system is that we have included a lot more information on the screen. So on this dashboard, for example, for this chemistry lab, in addition to information about the HVAC system, we also have uh, lighting information, fire system, and security information, as well as occupancy and window shade. So the intent here is to provide more value with the Metasys system. It's relatively easy for us to integrate these things now and provide a building operator with a more efficient way to go about their their day-to-day -day job. And I'm going to pull the, the fire pole station and immediately the fire strobe will start to flash because we have a real live fire loop implemented here. All of these devices, the fire pole station, the strobe and the smoke detector are all tied into a, a fire panel that we have uh, on kind of behind the scenes. You, can, you may be able to hear the, the fire panel in alarm, it's flashing and it, it's requiring your attention. The fire panel is tied into Metasys through BACnet IP. And we can use Metasys there then to indicate where the fire event has occurred. So Metasys already knows that somebody in the chemistry lab has pulled the fire pole station. Based, using that information, we can then automate the lighting fixtures and animate them to indicate which direction occupants should, should move to get out of the building safely. What is the Metasys UI show? Yeah, we can see that the pole station indicator has turned red. So we know right from there that there has been an event there. And then the strobe is also red uh, up here in the graphic. Uh, so both of those events have happened or both those uh, indicators have happened. And the operator may also want to utilize the camera. They could also click here on the actual indicator itself and it'll take you right in to have a, a visual of what's going on in the chemistry lab. See if there's smoke, you know, see what's you know, actually happening and have a more intelligent response. So if I were, if I were in the school and, I, and my badge wasn't granted access to the space and I scanned my badge at the card reader, the red light will indicate that my access has been denied and lights will start flashing to draw attention to the space that there's, there's an issue there. We're using uh, red beacons in the lighting fixtures also to draw attention that there's an error in the, in the scene. And what does the facility manager see from Metasys UI? So over here you can see in the security area of the screen there, it indicates right here that the access has been denied. And so it's flashing red to draw attention to it. And then in addition to that, uh, if you go over here, you can click on this camera and it would take you to a screen that's, that's, that's showing you the view from the camera. So if you want to investigate that straight away, you can. So yeah, there's our intruder.